What is up my friends, welcome to another episode of Andy Rocks and in this video we're gonna see some cool ways to modify your Android device or some cool ways to personalize your Android device or give your Android device a damn look. So before starting the video, let me just tell you in some cases you might need root but most of the time you won't need root. So no more wasting time, let's get started. All right, guys, I'm gonna show you 10 things that I modified in my Android device that looks cool to me. So let's start from the beginning. You'll definitely need a good launcher for your device just the way I installed Action Launcher, which is a really cool launcher to me, but it's, it's a paid launcher, guys, so it's not a free launcher, but it's really worth it with the money. You can download any uh, cracked or patched launcher from Google, but I don't recommend that because those applications have some bugs. Otherwise, you can install any other launchers, but in this launcher, you can change your dock. It has some gestures in it. So if you just swipe down, it shows you the notification panel. If you swipe up, it opens the app drawer. But the only thing in this application that I don't like is the application drawer is vertical. So it's not horizontal. I mean, you cannot swipe right or left. You have to just swipe up or down. Otherwise, I really love this launcher because uh, you can change each and every icon and these icons have uh, shortcut keys as well. So if you just tap and hold, you can get different shortcuts and it hides your status bar as well. So I don't have the status bar here. I don't have the navigation bar. It gives a cool look. Only the icons are here and the clean, neat and clean wallpaper. So now let's move on to icons, like how I can change the icons. If you have a Samsung device, guys, I mean, do not download the icons from Samsung Galaxy Store because they don't have a good collection there. In Samsung's default launcher, they don't support the third party icons like this. So that's a terrible thing, guys. That's why I don't use the Samsung's launcher. I only use third party launchers, which can support third party icons as well. So if I just tap here and then go to settings, you can see I have a icon pack here showing me so you can see I have installed different icons here you can tap here and click on edit then you can just you can rename your uh, application so it says phone you can just change it to a different one and if you just tap it it will show you different icon options as well if you just want to download the icons uh, you can just go to google play store then you can search here icons icon pack or icons whatever and you will see different tons of applications tons of icons which you can download from the google play store and which are totally free like and if you just don't want to pay just type the name and search in google uh, you can also find those icons for free uh, that's how i download the icons and install those so now let's move on to the next thing notification bar so in my device you can see i a little bit modified my notification bar so in samsung devices it's a different way samsung just launched launched an application called good lock and in the good lock you will see quick star you have the coloring things here and then if you just select one and you will get the edit option now here you can just modify each and everything the colors and everything you can just change it from here so we have color one color two background background transparency and all those things so it's a really cool feature that Samsung introduced so you don't need to root your device uh, otherwise if you are using any other application we have tons of applications in Google Play Store as well so let me just type you one so if you just search status status bar or material status bar you can see here we have the material status bar uh, this is a really good application that you can install in your device to modify your status bar i haven't installed it it yet because as i already have one from samsung if you are using any other devices uh, you can just use the material status bar to modify your status bar Otherwise, you can install the PowerShade, this application. This is a really good application as well. So as you can see, they are providing like these different type of options. You can just customize your status bar from here. So that's how guys, I 
uh, changed my status bar look like this and it's totally transparent and you can customize all your colors from here so if you guys are using Samsung devices and you want to you want to know more about the good luck or other customizations please let me know I will make more videos because my phone is rooted so now let's move on to the next one which, which is navigation bar if you just swipe it a little bit then you have like this I mean in Samsung devices you will see the option I mean the small arrow you can see facing downwards so if you just double tap that it hides and if you just do it again and double tap it it is locked here and I just modified it guys you can see so I used an application that's called substratum so again guys it's a paid application but you can also get it free if you just Google search it so this application is only for Samsung and it gives you tons of customization features and you can also use it in non-rooted device but you have to just follow the steps that's a very long video guys if you want to just know how you can do that just let me know I will make a separate video on substratum and that's about the substratum what I use to modify my uh, status bar or if you are using a different device not a Samsung device you can also install an application called navbar so this application works in a different way I mean it changes the navigation bar color so if you just turn it on you can see it changes the navigation bar color depending on what application you are using so if you are using Facebook it will become blue if you are using if you are using whatsapp this navigation bar will become green so this is how this application works guys it's called navbar all right let me just show you this application in Google Play Store so if you just search nav bar so the first application that you will get here like this it will show you like this you can see it has 1 million downloads and 4.3 ratings it's a really nice rating guys so you can you can use it and let me know in the comment section that if you are really enjoying this all right guys so now let me show you one more navigation bar modification and the name of the application is movies m u v i z movies so what this application actually does is whenever you play music or play videos it just give, gives you a visualization in your navigation bar so let me just show you movies want to all right so you have to allow this permission so as you can see guys it will show you like this it will always visualize your music in your navigation bar so that's such a nice good thing to see guys and you can also change the theme of the visualization so let's say i have selected this one all right so done all right so as you can see they offer many visualization themes here and you can also create your own one now guys let's talk about some gestures i mean you can see i always hide my navigation bar and my status bar because i don't need it i feel very annoying uh, whenever i need my status bar i just swipe it from the top it shows me, me the notification bar or the status bar whatever you say and uh, from if i swipe from the bottom from the middle i i can access to my task manager and if i just press here hard i mean you all guys know samsung have the pressure sensor here it brings to the home screen so that's a really cool feature guys if i swipe from left or swipe from right it takes me to the back screen I mean, i just have to swipe it from left or from right so let's say from this from this so you can see guys it's a cool feature so this is the application that i am using guys so the name of the application is all in just all in one gestures but unfortunately this application is not available right now in google play store to use these applications you can modify it however you want i will definitely upload the application link in the video description so you can just download this application from the link we had like uh, a lot of things to cover in this video and this video is gonna be a long one that's why i might not cover everything in this video so if you just have 
inquiry or if you think like I skipped something a little bit and you want to know more about that thing please let me know I will make more videos and let me just show you something before I finish this video so I just modified my whatsapp and you can see this is a black whatsapp people who's online right now you can see from here so you can see this this person is online right now so without opening the application you can also see so it's not the default whatsapp that you can find in google play store you have to just download it manually the name of the whatsapp is whatsapp plus i i will definitely give the link in the video to in the video description just you can download from this and you have tons of features as well you can just hide your last scene your blue ticks your second tick your writing status your recording status your blue microphone status view status and so on and uh, that's it guys and you have tons of options here to modify your chats or your chat rows and everything like that you can see here conversation screen pop-up screen and all those things so this topic would be a long one guys so that's it for today i think so if you just wanna uh, check this out i will definitely give a link in the video description so give it a try enjoy enjoy using your android device and be happy don't hate it if you think this video was helpful for you or you or you found something interesting or something helpful Make sure you hit the like button and if you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe as well because I always bring this kind of videos every week and I always try to interact with all of you guys. So that's it for today guys. See you in my next video. Keep rocking.